as part of their Keep It in the Ground event, local environmental organizations from Greenpeace to Stop Fracking Long Beach came together on July the 30th, 2016 on Cherry Beach in Long Beach, California to create a human sign that spelled no fracking. No fracking. But basically today we had several uh, environmental organizations come together. Greenpeace Orange County, Stop Fracking Long Beach, a um, couple branches of 350.org, for example, Long Beach 350, uh, Long uh, 350 South Bay. Um, also groups such as Save Banning Ranch, um, Ocean Defenders Alliance, Eco Media Compass, um, Sierra Club, we and a couple other groups. Um, we all came together in this message to spell out no fracking with our human bodies. Fracking is a very energy intensive process and fracking uses millions of gallons of water. Each well can use up to 8 million gallons and especially for the fact that California is in a drought, uh, that is not okay. Also for the fact that that fracking water can never be reused ever again. The fracking industry is working through this thing called the Halliburton loophole that was passed in 2005 and they, through hydraulic fracturing, um, they're actually exempt from conveying to the public the amounts of chemicals that they are using. It is estimated hundreds of chemicals are being used in the process and the public does not know what types of chemicals are being used and that is catastrophic and we are very much against that. Our endeavor is, is to get a, a moratorium on fracking in Long Beach. A lot of people don't know that fracking has pretty much been perfected here in Long Beach for the last 30 years. And currently, those oil islands out there, they are not fracking, but they are maintaining these wells, which is essentially is fracking, but they're not drawing out any oil product out of there, but they, the maintain, maintenance of it entails the same thing, that is injection of dangerous toxic chemicals into it and a lot of people don't understand or know that 30 percent of our water here in the city of Long Beach which we have a fabulous water department but 30 percent of the water that is that we drink comes from the aquifer that's right below our feet and that oil island over there has got pipes and and the chemicals are being sent over there and we are on a fault ladies and gentlemen, it strikes uh, the name of the fault, there's a specific name, it's not, it's uh, a, a, like a tributary to the San Andreas fault, but it comes right over where we're standing right here. And all the pipes and all these other things that are coming from that, we are next to this fault and it's gonna be a disaster in the making right here. Not to mention that it will, not in May, but it will affect our water supply. And uh, we need to put, a, at least for starters, a moratorium until more people could understand what the ramifications are of fracking in Long Beach. Today, my part in it was helping organize the people. Uh, I've done a few different aerial shots before uh, for Greenpeace and the Ecomedia Compass, and we got everyone to spell no fracking. And it's really powerful when people actually spell this with their bodies. That's a physical and it's an emotional investment in something that we all believe in here. So today, about 70 of us got down in the sand and said no fracking and took an aerial shot from the sky.